Damien Wills and uh, welcome to GoFly Online Quick Fix. Beside me we have Nathan Slee, the uh, Chief Pilot of GoFly Aviation. And today we're going to be looking at currency and a, a refresher flight in the SR20 Cirrus with the Avidyne system. Now uh, Nathan's a, uh, he is a grade 3 instructor and we're doing a check flight. Basically I do fly the Cirrus privately myself with the coronavirus lockdown. I hadn't flown it for about six weeks. Uh, and being an advanced, fairly advanced aircraft, uh, our policy with the school is uh, a check ride every 30 days, no matter what aircraft you're in, but in particular the Cirrus. Now, even though I've got a lot of experience, uh, as it's been over 30 days, I still need a check flight as well. Some aircraft uh, like the Cirrus with a, a complex um, uh, electronic flight instrumentation system, very easy to forget uh, how to use it in a small amount of time. So this is what Nathan's here for today to make sure that I'm safe. Then I, I stick to all the airspeeds and we're gonna look at, what, what are we gonna look at today, Nathan? So we'll mainly look at uh, your approach feeds, make sure they're safe. Yep. Make sure you're hitting the numbers as well. Yep. In this aircraft, it's extremely important to hit the numbers. Yep. Uh, we can get really fast and then they'll just keep us way too fast and too high on approach. Yep. Uh, we're also gonna look at making sure you hit the correct power settings yep. with your flap settings as well. Okay. Uh, making sure that we have the 85 knots with full flap on final approach. Yep. Uh, slowing down to 80 over the fence. Yep. Um, yep. And as far as systems? As far as the systems go, we'll make sure you get it all in the right order. Yep. Make sure you can remember how to program it for your autopilot as well. Yes. And again, sequencing that all correctly as well. We'll okay. also look at updating the software as well on the Avidyne. Okay, sure, because that's, that's one thing. Actual flying part, I don't tend to forget, but the systems itself, uh, particularly how to use the uh, autopilot, yep. uh, you tend to get a bit uh, a bit grey in the head because I'm not using it all the time. So that's what I'll be looking at today. But okay, well, let's go flying and have some fun. Cool, let's do it. Okay, we're going to look at the, the flight management system again, um, putting a plan in. So just say I'm not happy with that plan. How do I delete it and start again? All right, so we've got all our waypoints selected on the screen. Yep. Let's say we wanted to get rid of Kavulcha. Yeah. Let's scroll up to Kavulchas. Yep. It's now selected. We're going to delete that waypoint. Gotcha. Enter. Enter. Yep. Now it's all good. So they enter some new ones in. We come down to here. Yep. Onto our uh, QWERTY put, keypad. Our QWERTY keypad here. So I'll put Kavulcha in again. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll say YK. I'll say King Roy. Yeah, let's go uh, YK uh, R Y. OK, uh, Y. There it is. We can enter that. So yep. it's good. King Roy, Roy yep. that's what we want. Yeah, enter. Yep. And, now it's and then I want to come back to Calandra again. That's just yep. Y. Y C D R. C. Uh, I missed the Y. So if I make a mistake. Yep. Just clear. clear it. Y. Y C D R. And then enter. And that's it. That's it. Yep. Easy. First of all, you'd like me to do a stall? Yeah, we'll go through a stall. Okay, so obviously we do our stall uh, checklist. So a height sufficient to recover up to 2,500, uh, which we are. Uh, airframe, uh, we're clean. We've trimmed the aircraft. Autopilot is off. Uh, and we're going to put our boost pump on. Yep. And uh, security, we're secure. Nothing's going to fly around. Uh, all the switches that are required to be on uh, are on. North, north, east, north, 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 and uh, engine, all our temperatures and pressures are all in the, in the uh, green, which they are. Location, but not a, not a built up area, uh, which is important for a store. And look, I'm going to do a, a, a 180 turn back to the other way, and I'll look out for any aircraft. So clear my left, clear my center, clear my right. All right, look out, listen out complete, there's no one around us. Yep. Okay, so we're going to go. Throttle back to idle. Important we don't trim the stall. And we're looking for the identification markers, which is uh, diminishing airspeed, higher angle of attack, floppy controls. Everything's getting sloppier. Little warning going off. Caution, understeed. Yeah, there we go. We want to see a little bit of a break. Yep. And Caution, understeed. There's the buffer there. We're going to recover. Fox 
SP build up. I've got to restore it. Yep, there we go. Power, full power. Caution, under speed. Okay, so we're going to look at our, our uh, autopilot now. So, autopilot is off at the moment. We've got our um, flight. FMS up here, showing out the plan to Caboolture, yep. Caloundra. So, to move it to Caloundra, uh, Caboolture is on there, there now. Yep. So, right. it's now. so we just use our scroll select here. Which is just there? Yeah, so it's, it's, we're now currently on in Caboolture. Okay, so Nathan, so we've actually entered in Caboolture here but already, but we're a bit off track. So, we're on, the, on, this, on the FMS here, we've got that being direct to. Yep. And I've used the scroll button here to go to yeah, put that little square around Caboolture. Yep. Okay. So, what we need to do is make sure that we're on. Um, do I hit nav? Uh, on the autopilot? Yep. So, nav on the autopilot. So, nav and, and alt. Nav and alt. Yep, yep. which is the um, nav and alt there already. Yep. So at the moment it's wanting to take us to Calandra because Calandra is the one that's selected. Oh, we just like to Calandra, okay. So we need to activate Cavultures. So I just hit the direct two. That's correct. Direct two, Cavultures, enter. Enter. And now it should take us back onto our planned trek to Cavultures. Gotcha. Now so obviously when you're on other parts, you still want to look around for other aircraft. Yep. So we're now it's now turning us onto. So we have that nav selected, we have alt selected, yep, and that's what the autopilot is now following. Right, so nav, alt, uh, from our flight plan, and we've obviously got the direct to button for Caboolture here. So it should pick up that. That track direct to Caboolture. And what I love about this is like it tells you how many miles, how many minutes till we arrive at Caboolture, which is just incredible. Um, so if I now want to, okay, we're done with, I don't want to go to Caboolture anymore, I want to head back to Calandra for some circuits. I would uh, scroll down to Calandra. Yep, that's correct. Yep, so scroll down. So we're on Calandra now. And if I hit direct two again. You can, you can activate leg. I'll just activate leg there. Yep. So, and that'll take it. So activate leg to Calandra. Activate, enter. So, yep. And we're looking around. It's doing a nice turn. Should do a turn back. There we go, hands off the controls. And it'll take us straight back to Glander. Yep. Hey, so we're getting in, in circuit now. What I've had noticed is, yeah, we're doing a lot of our flying on, on the sling recreational aircraft at 100 knots, coming in at 130, 140 knots. Everything happens a lot quicker. Uh, I like to turn the autopilot off as I enter circuit area. Uh, particularly with a lot of aircraft around, you want to be able to manoeuvre quickly. So on this aircraft, we uh, hit the red button twice to just click the autopilot. Hit that, that ring first and the second hit on the button. We can see autopilot ready there, we're off. Okay, we'll start descending. And it looks like one, two. Are you using? Yep. I count there's two in the circuit. Yep. Fuel sufficient for our flight. Check, yep. And on this tank, instruments on the green. Which is the one that are required to be on. Hatches and harness secure. Yep. yep. And wind down the runway. Yep. An aircraft. Any final. Beam the end of the runway. Power back to 25%. Holy transition to that level off. Traffic. As one o'clock. High. One mile. Lowering the traffic. Traffic system. <laughs> Runway one two for local flight. Clear traffic, Charlie. Golf, turning base. Runway one two. Touch and go. Clear traffic. Well, thank you, Nathan. That was uh, highly enjoyable. Okay. Uh, as you can see, I was a little bit rusty uh, with flying the Cirrus. Um, always love flying it. Beautiful plane to fly. Um, obviously, the systems um, were the ones that you know I, I tend to forget. Yep. Uh, but I feel a lot more confident now um, with the systems and obviously landing the plane itself. <laughs> and feel a lot safer to take my family up now. So, um, um, thanks a lot for the day. No problem at all. Okay. <laughs> and uh, remember to uh, like us on the GoFly uh, online YouTube page or go to GoFly, uh, www.gofly.online to see more free videos. Thanks a lot and see you next time.